This is more of a progress update on how CJ's ship is coming along. So since back when I left off this project, I created a smaller ship for CJ. The previous ship was way too big to fit inside my green screen. But I think I will go back and finish that larger ship too and just make another larger green screen. But anyway, that's for another day. Originally, I wanted to create a new, very different looking ship for CJ, but I decided that she should just get Jolly Roger and name it Jolly Roger Jr. or something. I think that would be a lot more consistent to how the Descendants kids work their magic. They do inherit some qualities that are very similar to their parents. In case of CJ, that would be Captain Hook which means her ship has to look more or less like her father's. So I started another ship. This is a much smaller ship than what I originally had. Not just in size, but also the design of the ship. The mast is shorter, the length is also shorter anyway. It kind of looks like a paper boat at this point, but I think this will look more like a ship after we put everything in. I want to do some extensive pirate stories in the future with these ships. So some 2D image cutouts that we used to do wouldn't work. I guess the first step would be to make Jolly Roger. And then we will go down the list of all the ships we need to build. For the close-up shots, there will be another stage. This ship will be used to show where the other ships are in relation to other objects in the story. Anyway, I guess we'll, we'll figure this out as we go. CJ's ship was supposed to be resurrected in this series. Kakamoros are supposed to invite themselves to the wedding, but I'm going to move all of that stories to the next series. So we need to build a lot of ships before that series can go ahead, including the Kakamoros ship that I left off unfinished. For now, I'm trying to build something that looks pretty similar to Jolly Roger. First, I made the kill and then attached the walls. I used a lot of stir sticks for the walls. And then I also used a lot of stir sticks to lay down the floors. I haven't glued the floors to the ship yet because I need to go back and make some openings for the cannon windows. I want to attach another layer of stir sticks to the walls so I have thicker walls. I ran out of stir sticks, so this would be a good place to stop for now until I go shopping for more stir sticks. Next, I used three wooden dowels for the three masts. I cut out thinner dowels and connected them to the thicker mast using little wooden clips that I made. I haven't glued anything down yet because I need to come back and paint everything. I made little holes on the floors so the masts can get in. Just the friction alone seems to be okay for the mast to stay upright. It looks like there are another thinner mast on top, so it looks like I need to come back and extend the length of these masts. There is still a lot of work that needs to go into these masts. I also cut out some white clothes for the sails. I painted some red stripes to make them look like Jolly Roger. I loosely tied them onto the mast for now. I will be coming back and installing some proper ropes to hold all of this together. So this is where the ship is now. I think the next step would be to thicken the walls and then add some decorations. Also paint the walls too. So that's where it is. See you in the next video.